Hey, Mike Draper here with Jay Racing University, and I want to explain today a ground tie off of a residential roof. We would uh, really like to have, when we show up on a job and we're going to uh, implement fall protection on the roof, we'd like to have a hitch that would sit like this at the peak of the roof, and we would tie into it. But oftentimes that isn't the case, and uh, maybe installation is not an option. So our next best bet is a ground tie situation. This illustrates a, a hip roof here, and our best case scenario is to have an anchor on this side and an anchor on this side and a rope thrown over the center of the house. Now we can see that that's demonstrated here on this roof where we've got a knot tied in the center and then both of these would go over to anchors. So you might be asking, well, which anchor would I use on either side of the house? Well, we're gonna talk about one of them today and that's the Conterra uh, hitch plate anchor. So this anchor fits into a Reese hitch uh, it allows, uh, it gets snapped in place or pinned into place there by the Reese hitch. It does have a manufacturer stamp on it, which is always king. We want the manufacturer stating that this is a rated anchor. And then what would happen is our rope would connect into it like this and then be thrown over the house. So this would give us one of our anchor points on a ground tie. Now, one word of caution, if we are going to implement the Conterra hitch plate, we would want to also implement a lockout tag out on the truck so that no one could uh, drive or pull away with somebody up on the roof. Uh, this is just a glimpse of a ground tie. I'm Mike Draper with Jay Racing University.